Today we will see what is non-repudiation and cyber security. Before getting into the topic, I'll just walk you through a few seconds on what is repudiation. Repudiation means denial of the fact, where we often come across a statement, no I didn't do it. For example, Bob done some changes in the configuration of a server or modify the data but denies the fact. How do we prove it? With that question, let's see what is non-repudiation. Non-repudiation is the assurance that someone cannot deny their involvement. If you have a proper techniques and tools of the non-repudiation, we'll be able to prove the people's involvement on any kind of transaction, whether it's a bank transfer or a chat or a data modification during the transit or a trust. Does authentication alone is enough for non-repudiation? Absolutely not. Authentication can only claims on the validity of the event, but other non-repudiation techniques can claim the fact of the event. There are four different phases involved in the entire non-repudiation process. Evidence generation, where you will collect all the information related to the incident. Evidence transfer, where you will confirm the efficiency and timeliness. Evidence verification, where you will start to verify the entire information. Dispute resolution, with this you will be able to settle the dispute of the two parties with the verified evidence that has been stored. Now we will see what are the different types of non-repudiation. Non-repudiation origin, NRO. This one is to prove the origin of a message. Second, non-repudiation of deliver, NRD. This one is to prove the delivery of the message. And third, non-repudiation of the receipt, NRR. This one is proof of the receipt of the message. Finally, let's see what are the, some techniques involved in the non-repudiation. Digital signature which validates the information of data being modified with some deep cryptographic evaluation, whether it's done in which system or through some coding through the transit. Authentication will help us to prove the identity. Cyber forensic analysis and audit trail will give you the complete picture of the incident and the timeline which will help to validate the fact. Thank you so much. If you like the video, please like and subscribe the channel.